I'm here with Kevin McCaria, the UNH men's hockey team, a chance to learn more about one of the Wildcats here. So, Kevin, thanks for joining us. First of all, let's start. Let's go as far back as we can in terms of your hockey career. When did you first get on skates and get out there and start playing? I actually started a little bit late. I, uh, I started playing hockey when I was seven years old. Uh, it was my, my neighbor who said um, we were playing knee hockey in the basement, like the little sticks. And his, uh, his mother convinced my mother to learn to skate lessons. That's how it started. And, it uh, secretly was hockey practice, but um, she knew my mom wouldn't go for it at the time. and um, So my mom originally thought it was skating lessons, and it ended up to be hockey, and I got hooked right from the start. So that's how my, my hockey career started. When you've introduced yourself to other people, have, has anybody else ever said the reason I got into hockey is because of my neighbor's mom? <laughs> Not too many. Not everyone normally they grew up with, they have someone in their family playing. But, I mean, I got an older cousin who played, but, I mean, my family, my parents, Neither of them ever had a hockey background, so it's, it's a unique story, but it's clever. Well, the fact that you've stuck with it this long and ended up as a UNH Wildcat now going into your senior year, what was it about UNH that attracted you? Uh, just the uh, environment and community here. Um, I took my visit here, and I had a uh, tremendous time. I mean, the, uh, the entire team at that point, too, so supportive. So um, together as a team, and, you know, the coaching staff, obviously, is a uh, tremendous staff, and just uh, the fans here in the community here supporting us. Before you became a Wildcat, you did have a chance to skate with the U.S. development team. I imagine that had to be a great experience. A uh, wonderful experience just to uh, play with a group of guys like that. That I mean, you know, We all had the same, same goals to, to move on to uh, bigger things. and uh, Just the experiences, too, being able to play at that level and play uh, internationally. Got to go overseas multiple times, four or five times, so just a great experience. You're younger then, but how does that competition compare to what it's like, the rigors of Hockey East? Uh, you know, it's the same. I mean, there it's competitive where, you know, you work against each other, you know, every day battling against each other. But um, Hockey East is obviously a great league. We, we had a chance to play a couple teams from Hockey East. Um, back then, I think we played uh, Maine and UMass. Um, but just a great experience to, you know, have that opportunity to play for that organization. Still a lot of hockey left to be played this season, but it's still your senior campaign. What are your goals for the rest of the season? Um, I still want to uh, win a Hockey East championship. That'd be a tremendous goal of uh, this class, especially. I think uh, last year we made it down to Boston, and hopefully we can uh, win a couple more games down there and be able to win a Hockey East championship. Beyond hockey and beyond UNH, what are some of Kevin McCary's goals moving forward? Uh, I always want to be involved with hockey. I'm looking to be a coach after hockey. It's my major here. I'm a sports studies major. And, um, I work now with the local uh, Oyster River High School. I help coach there. Um, hopefully just stick with hockey, stay with hockey, and uh, see how long I can have fun with it for. We're glad your mom decided to let you play hockey. It's been a great Thank career. You. Best of luck Thank the rest you. of the way. Thank you very much.